Hello boys and girls, it's Mr. Cobb here for uh, your weekly music lesson. Um, today we're going to talk about something that we have talked about before, or that you've talked about before in music, um, and that is pitch. Now, if you don't remember what pitch is, just to recap, pitch is how high or how low a sound is. How high or how low a sound is. So in music... High notes and low notes, or pitches, are read on a staff like this one. And that staff has uh, five lines. One, two, three, four, five. And where those notes are placed tells us if it is a low pitch or if it is a high pitch. But they could also be anywhere in between, like that. Okay, So we can think of our staff and the notes like steps on a ladder. Okay? Notes at the bottom are the low notes, and then notes at the top are the high notes. Okay, but we don't just go from here all the way to here when we climb a ladder. So as you move up the ladder, that pitch gets higher. Okay, and if you are going down the ladder, the pitch gets lower. So Notes can do a few different things. They can stay in the same place in a song, like these two, and that is when they repeat, or they can move up or down in steps, skips, and leaps. And here we have what a step looks like on the staff. Here we have what a skip looks like on the staff. And here we have what a leap looks like on the staff. Okay, and that's what we call melodic direction. When we have the notes going up and down and stepping and skipping and leaping and doing all those different things, that's called melodic direction. So let's look at this a different way. So here we've got a piano keyboard. And when you play notes on the piano, they start at the left for the low notes and then they go all the way to the right for the high notes. So if I start here on my lowest note, and I play that note, and then I play the very next note beside it, that is called a step, okay? And you can think about this like a set of stairs. You step from one step to the very next one. You're stepping. Now, if I stay on that same note, but this time I jump ahead and I skip a note by skipping this one, this would be called a skip in music, okay? because I'm skipping this note. Okay, now, that last thing was leaps. If you skip more than two notes, or two notes or more, then that is called a leap, or some people call them jumps. So, from the, uh, the first key all the way up here would be a leap. 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 Okay? So, but I also said that notes can move up or they can move down. So if I start here and I go to that key right to the left of it, I'm stepping down, okay? Whereas before I was stepping up, now I'm stepping down, okay? So now I'm going to skip down and now I'm going to leap down. So all of those would be leaps, okay? So... Um, those are the three things, steps, skips, and leaps, but notes can also stay the same, and in a lot of uh, really popular songs, you hear all of these different things, and when the, they get combined, then that's how really cool melodies are made, and we'll talk about melody in another video, but there's a link to a really cool website um, where you can play a virtual piano, and you can either do it on your computer, or you can do it on a tablet or an iPad, um, where you just uh, touch the screen to play the piano, but what I want you to do is I want you to try to uh, come up with something using steps, skips, leaps, um, or maybe just use uh, maybe one or two of those things and see if you can come up with some things that you think sound really cool. So until the next time um, that we have music, uh, I want you guys to stay safe and please remember to have fun. Thanks.